Hello students and good morning. So now I'm doing class for class 10. The topic is right circular cylinder. So in the last line and in the last online class also we were doing the same topic that is right circular cylinder and in that online class we did some problems. So today we'll do more problems on this chapter that is right circular cylinder. So same exercise, exercise 8, uh, page number 147 from the book Ganit Prakash for class 10 by West Bengal Board of Secondary Education. So now let's uh, start this question number 13. So in the last online class we did question number 12. I think you revise all the problems that we did so far in the chapter right circular cylinder. Okay, so now let's start this question number 13. 13 is the length of inner and outer diameter of a right circular cylindrical pipe open at the two ends are 30 centimeter and 26 centimeter respectively. The you question my order pipe ko kura gade sa. You pipe se kosa sa order hollow pipe hollow right circular cylinder bane bani cha. You jun se pipe sa pipe ko bitra se ki unse khokro unse dai na bitra ke pani unse na pipe ma. The hollow cylinder bane ko ni bitra se hi ke na bhaye ko. Tela bansa hami hollow right circular cylinder. Pipe is just like a hollow right circular cylindrical pipe. So, the pipe is not in the same way. So, this is the inner and outer diameter of the right circular cylindrical pipe is given as the inner diameter is given as the length of the inner and outer diameter. The length of the inner and outer diameter of a right circular cylinder pipe open at two ends are 30 cm and 26 cm respectively. That means uh, you 30 centimeters outer you 30 centimeters outer and 26 centimeters this is your inner diameter so this pipe is a hollow uh, right circular cylindrical pipe its outer diameter is 30 centimeter and the inner diameter is 26 centimeter okay and what is the length of the pipe given? It is 14.7 meter. What is the length of the pipe? It is 14.7 meter. So let us write by calculating the cost of painting its all surfaces with coal tar at rupees 2.25 per square decimeter. So what is the This pipe pipe is the pipe that is the pipe Paint gore with the coal tar. Coal tar bane ko kalo mosole elai dolio. Ta baira ko vari paripani dolsa. Bitra ko vari paripani dolsa. Ani side surfaces man dolsa. Ta isko open ends. Isko junsei khulla bhag unsa. Tio open ends ma. Isko end ma pani. Isko dui tira junsei end bhag sa. Isko dui tira junsei end. Portion sa, two end portion ma pani, uh, you call tarle paint karin sa. Take sa, just say abo ya figure bonon pari figure kosto unsa banda very pipe ko. This is the right circular cylindrical pipe. This is of hollow shape, bitra kepan na bhai ko. Okay. So your hollow pipe, okay? The hollow pipe, but I go. I'm really busy, you know. So this is the hollow cylindrical pipe, right? So this is the hollow cylindrical pipe. Bitra se khokro sa. Bitra ke ben sahi na te isma. Thik sa? Ta isko outer diameter. Outer diameter bane ko yoh sab pahi. Yeh dekhi ko yeh sama. Isko outer diameter ko te dekho sa? 30 centimeter. Its outer diameter is what? It is your 30 centimeter. Ani inner diameter. What is the inner diameter? Inner diameter bane ko yoh. So its inner diameter is 26 centimeter. 
its inner diameter is what it is 26 centimeter respectively and what is the length of the pipe it is 14.7 meter so this is the length of the pipe it is given as 14.7 meter so let us write by calculating the cost of painting its all surfaces with coal tar at rupees 2.25 per square decimeter so what do you do this? You have to do this in your own way. You have to do this in your own way. You have to do this in your own way. You have to do this in your own way. You have to do this in your own way. And you have to do this in your own way. You have to do this in your own way. So your total surface area of the hollow cylindrical pipe. I will tell you how to do this. So your total surface area. So total surface area. Now, uh, total surface area, total surface area of the cylindrical pipe, of the cylindrical pipe, total surface area of the cylindrical pipe is equal to, so how can you, how can you find out the total surface area of the cylindrical pipe? So, it's called worry pari. So, it's called worry pari banale. बाहर तीर अपनी पेंट करें इंसा तो बाहर तीर बने वैसे इसको आउटर रेडियस आयो बाहर तीर बने वैसे इसका आउटर रेडियस आयो व्हाट इज़ इस आउटर कोर्स सरफेस एरिया इट इज़ टू पाई आर वन एच इट इज़ टू पाई आर वन एच यो आर वन से क्या बा आउटर रेडियस बैगो ठीक सा यो आर वन से क्या बा � तो इसको बाहर पड़ी को कॉर्ड सरफेस एरिया को फॉर्मूला क्यों 2 पाई आर वन एच प्लस अब भीतर पड़ी बनी पेन गरीन सा तो पाइप को भीतर पड़ी पेन गरीन सा तो भीतर से हमें क्या बन सो इन रेडियस सपोज़ द इन रेडियस इज़ आर टू 2 पाई आर टू एच यू हैव टू ऐड दिस इनर सरफेस एरिया आल्सो इनर कॉर्ड सरफेस ए अब मातिलो पोर्शन रो तल्लो पोर्शन पनी हमें जोड़ने पर्स। तो मातिलो पोर्शन में क्या उनसा बंदा फेरी? यो R1 बायो, this is your R1, that is your R1. R1 is the inner radius, और यो सब पे इसके बाद outer radius, outer radius से कोटी बाह R2, outer radius से के बाह R2। तो माती पनी सर्कल उनसा, तल्लो पनी सर्कल उनसा। तो र त्यों सर्कल से कौसो टाइम में देख सामी रिंग में देख सो कि ना भीतर पर इतना खोगरोसन था हमें यो बाहर को यो एरिया मत निकालो बर्स तो त्यों एरिया हमें कौसरी निकाल सो बंदा फेरी यो जून से एरिया ऑफ़ द आउटर सर्कल सा एरिया ऑफ़ द आउटर सर्कल का दिवा पाई आर टू स्क्वायर एरिया ऑफ़ द आउटर सर्कल का दिवा पाई आर टू स्क्वायर एरिया ऑफ़ द आउटर सर्कल का दिवा यू नो द फॉर्मूला पाई आर टू स्क्वायर अन्य यो जून से इना सर्कल सा इना सर्कल को एरिया को ती बायो पाई आर वन स्क्वायर ता आउटर सर्कल माइनस इनर सर्कल कर दा से हमें निकी निकाल सो यो एरिया ऑफ दिस रिंग यो एरिया ऑफ दिस साइड सरफेस इस दैट लियो यो मैथिलो पोर्शन में जून से एरिया था त्यो एरिया हमें निकालो सकते हो बाय सब्ट्रैक्टिंग तो इसमें पाई आर टू स्क्वायर से क्या बा एरिया ऑफ़ द आउटर सर्कल अन्य पाई आर वन स्क्वायर से क्या बा एरिया ऑफ़ द इनर सर्कल अन्य दूसरा को डिफरेंस है दूसरा को डिफरेंस ले से हमें लाकी दिन सा एरिया ऑफ़ द रिंग दैट मींस एरिया ऑफ़ द अपर पोर्शन तो तल्लो एरिया पर नहीं हमें तेजस्वी � पाई आर टू स्क्वायर माइनस पाई आर वन स्क्वायर करता है फिरी हमें ले यो एरिया हमें नहीं निकालने सकते सो दैट इस एरिया ऑफ़ द रिंग व्हिच इस इन द लोअर पोर्शन तो तेला हमें ले कौसे मल्टीप्लाय कर सों माथीलो एरिया निकाले हो माथीलो एरिया ऑफ़ द रिंग निकाले तेला कौतिलो मल्टीप्लाय करने में टू ल Two pi r one square. It is two pi r one square. बुझे? ये two ले से हमें किना मल्टीप्लाई करियो बंदा फिरे माथी पनी सर्कल सा तल्ला पनी सर्कल संदा 
तो मतलब एरिया भी निर्णन पर्व तल्लो एरिया भी निर्णन पर्व ते कारण हमें इस टू ले मल्टिप्लाई गये ठीक है अब तो यह दुटा में कति कमन निस्क्य टू पाई एच यह दुटा में टू पाई एच कमन निस्क्यो विद इन ब्रैकेट कर् वन प्लस आर टू आई थिंक अब स्टूडेंट यह दुटा में कति कमन निस्क्यो प्लस टू पाई विद इन ब्रैकेट आर टू स्क्वायर माइनस आर वन स्क्वायर तो यह भाई के भो भादा फिर टू पाई इंटू आर टू स्क्वायर माइनस आर वन स्क्वायर से एरिया अफ दी अपर पोर्सन प्लस एरिया अफ द लोअर पोर्सन यो टू पाई एच इंटू आर वन प्लस आर टू बने के एरिया अफ द आउटर कप सफेस प्लस एरिया अफ द इनर कप सफेस तो ये टोटल सफेस एरिया में के लगन पे पेन्ट कर एटा बाहरपटी पेन्ट कर भिपटी पेन कर ओपन एंड में दुई तीर ओपन एंड हो तो दुई तीर ओपन एंड में पेन्टिंग करो टोटल सफेस एरिया को फर्मुला के हो टू पाई आर वन एच प्लस टू पाई आर टू एच प्लस दैट इज अब मथि पोर्सन हे फिर एरिया अफ द आउटर सर्कल माइनस एरिया अफ द इनर सर्कल मथि भी तल भी तो कारण यहाँ टू रे मल्टिप्लाई गए तो यहाँ हमें कमन निकाल टू पाई कमन सो विद इन ब्रैकेट व्हाट डू वी गेट आर टू स्क्वायर माइनस आर वन स्क्वायर इज दैट क्लियर नाउ सो हि आर वन इज इक्वल टू इनर रेडियस आर वन इज इक्वल टू इनर रेडियस एंड व्हाट इज आर टू हि आर टू इज द आउटर रेडियस सो इज दैट क्लियर टू ऑल ऑफ यू so this is the total surface area of the cylindrical pipe this is the formula that you should use here so i think you have understood this figure so you can copy it so you can note it down timale yo sarnu khata ma copy gara lo aba hami yo formula use garchau to get the total surface area of the right circular cylindrical pipe okay kinabhane eti surface area ma chai ke garincha पेन्ट कर ठीक सो यू कैन कपी इट नाउ विल डू द प्रब्लम नाउ सो फर्स्ट अफ अल दिस इज द फर्मुला राइट सो नाउ सो दिस इज द सोल्यूशन नाउ इन दिस केस What is the outer diameter? Outer diameter is thirty centimeter. So outer diameter, outer diameter is equal to thirty centimeter. So here we have taken R two as the outer radius. Your outer diameter is thirty centimeter. This half of the diameter will give you the radius, right? That is R two. R two is equal to thirty by two, which is equal to 15 सेंटीमीटर सो आई थिंक अब अंडरस्टूड इट नेक्स्ट व्हाट इज द इनर डायमीटर हियर इनर डायमीटर इज 26 सेंटीमीटर सो इनर डायमीटर इनर डायमीटर इज इक्वल टू हाउ मच इज दैट दिस इज योर 26 सेंटीमीटर सो व्हाट इज द इनर रेडियस नाउ हियर आर वन व्हाट इज द वैल्यू फॉर आर वन आर वन इज इक्वल टू दिस इज 26 by 2, which is equal to 13 centimeter. That is the inner radius. Okay, R1 is the inner radius. And what is the value for h? What is the uh, length of the pipe? It is 14.7 meter. So length of the pipe is 14.7 meter. That is height of the pipe. What is the height of the pipe? The height of the pipe is equal to 14.7 meter. 14.7 meter. So I think you have understood it. Now in this case, you have to find out. You have to calculate the cost of painting its all surfaces with coal tar at rupees 2.25 per square decimeter. The bira ko area ma pani bira ko vari pari ko area man paint garsa. भित्र को वरीपरी को एरिया में पेन कर प्लस तो ओपन एंड जो दुई दुई तीर एटा एटा एकपटी होता पछाड़ी होता अगड़ी होता पछाड़ी होता पेन करो पेन कर 
कति रेट में खर्च होने एक स्क्वायर डेसिमीटर को खर्च कति होने रुपीज टू पॉइंट टू फाइव भरी सब में तो टोटल सर्फेस एरिया में नहीं पेन कर खर्च लगे तो निल दैट मिन्स यू हेव टू फाइंड आउट दी टोटल सर्फेस एरिया अफ द राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंड्रिकल पाइप सो दिस फर्मुला इज टू बी यूज ओके सो इट इज गिवन इन टर्म्स अफ पर स्क्वायर डेसिमीटर तो यह सेंटीमीटर हम डेसिमीटर में ला अटर में हम डेसिमीटर में ला क्यों एवट यूनिट में हमें लान जरूरी तो सेंटीमीटर लेसिमीटर में ला फिर सेंटीमीटर देखि डेसिमीटर ठूल यूनिट हो तो टेन ने डिवाइड यू नो दैट सो इट इज फिफ्टीन बाई टेन को वन को पचर एवं जीरो तो मतबड़ी एवं फिगर डेसिमल लाइन वन पॉइंट फाइव डेसिमीटर This is 1.5 decimeter, okay? This is 13 centimeter converted into decimeter. So 13 by 10 divided by that, what is it? 1.3 decimeter. As you know that, 10 le divided by that, one ko pasre orda zero. So mathi badi orda fear orda decimal orda three ko orda decimal unsa? That is 1.3 decimeter. Abo 14.7 meter lai me decimal orda na thavi. Meter dekhi decimeter se sai sanu unit mai me change orda iso. तो सानो यूनिट में चेंज कर मल्टिप्लाई कर कति मल्टिप्लाई टेन ले सो फोर्टीन पॉइंट सेवेन इंटू टेन इज इक्वल टू वन फोर सेवेन जीरो राइट सो आफ्टर डेसिमल पॉइंट ओनली वन फिगर इज देयर सो यू हेफ टू राइट डाउन डेसिमल पॉइंट बिफोर वन जीरो सो विच इज इक्वल टू वन फोर्टी सेवेन डेसिमीटर सो आई थिंक यू हेव अंडरस्टूड इट सो दिज आर गिवन इन द क्वेश्चन ओके Now let us find out the total surface area of the right circular cylindrical pipe. So this is the formula, right? So therefore, total surface area, total surface area of the cylindrical pipe of the cylindrical pipe is equal to what is the formula? Write down this formula. That is two pi h within bracket r one plus r two, okay, plus two pi, and within bracket r one is square minus sorry, this is r two. R two is the outer radius. R two is square minus minus what? R one is square. So this is the formula for total surface area of the cylindrical pipe, okay. So now let us put the values now, which is equal to two into what is pi? Pi means twenty-two by seven, and what is the height? What is the height of the pipe or length of the pipe? It is one forty-seven, and within bracket, what is R one? R one is one point three plus what is R two? R two is one point five. We can you can write it from here. Plus two into pi is twenty-two by seven, and within second bracket, what is R two whole square? It is one point five whole square minus what is R one whole square? It is one point three whole square. So this is the total surface area area of the right circular cylindrical pipe. So let us simplify it now. Seven ones are seven. Seven twos are fourteen. Seven ones are seven. Right. So is equal to how much is it now? Two into twenty-two is forty-four into twenty-one into. You can add it. Two point eight. Two point eight plus two into twenty-two by seven into. Now this is just like your formula a square minus b square. What is the formula a square minus b square? A plus b into a minus b. So it is 1.5 plus 1.3 into 1.5 minus 1.3. Is that clear? That is your a plus b into a minus b. So which is equal to? Now you can multiply here. So you can multiply it. So I think you have copied it. So you can copy it. Now we can multiply this uh, 44 into 21 into 2.8. And here also you have to simplify it, okay? So I'm rubbing it. This one. So 
So next, multiply 44 by 21. Multiply 44 by 21. Here it is 44 into 21. Okay? Do multiply go 1 4 are 4, 1 4 are 4. Right? 2 4 are 8, 2 4 are 8. This is 4, 8 plus 4, 12, 2, 1, 9, 9, 24. So here you write 9 to 4 into 2.8. Plus 2 into 22 by 7 into what is 1.5 plus 1.3? It is 2.8 into 1.5 minus 1.3, that is 0 0.2. Is that clear? So here you can cancel this 7 ones are 7, 0 0.74s are 28. Okay, so which is equal to now again you have to multiply this 924 into 2.8. So 924 is multiplied by 2.8. Okay. So let's multiply it. 8 fours are 32. 2, 3, 8 twos are 16 plus 8 fours are 32. 2, 3, 8 twos are 16 plus 3 is 19. 99, 1. 9 eights are 72 plus 1 is 73. Cross. It is 2 fours are 8. 2 twos are 4. 9 twos are 18. So let us check it once again. 8 fours are 32, 2, 3, 8 twos are 16, plus 3 is 19, 9, 1, 9 eights are, 9 is are 72, plus 1 is 73. Now again multiply it by 2, 2 fours are 8, uh, 2 twos are 4, 9 twos are 18. Okay, add them, 2, 9 plus 8, 7, 17, 7, 1, 4 plus 4 is 8, 8 plus 7 is 15, uh, 1, 2. So decimal point. Uh, so after decimal point there is one figure so you have to write down decimal point before one figure that is before two so it is so how much is it two five eight seven two five eight seven point two two five eight seven point two plus now let us multiply two into forty four two into twenty two that is forty four multiply by this is four twos are eight right four into two is eight but after decimal point there is one figure here also after decimal point there is one figure one plus one is two that means you have to write down decimal point before two figures right so you order figure by go eight also at zero top here point is that clear now multiply 44 into point zero eight so it is two five eight seven point two plus eight fours are thirty two two three uh, 8 fours are 32 plus 3 is what is 32 plus 3 35 so after decimal point there is two figures after decimal point there are two figures you have to write down decimal point before two figures that is before 2 and 5 it is 3.52 I think you have understood it so let us add them so 2587.2 plus 3.52 2587.2 plus what? 3.52. That means 3 is written below 7. 0 0.52. 0 0.52. Here you can add 0 here. So you can add them. This is 27.7 plus 3 is 10. 0, 1, 8 plus 1 is 9. 5, 2. So how much is it now? It is 2590. 2590.2. 72 square decimeter so what is it now this is the total surface area of the right circular cylindrical pipe the 80 square decimeter ma chai ke garnu cha painting garnu parcha thik cha ta kati kharcha lagcha ta abo ya question ma deko cha cost of painting one square decimeter is equal to rupees 2.25 so what is the cost of painting 2590.72 square decimeter so you have to find out the uh, cost cost of painting this right circular cylindrical pipe okay so now I am rubbing this one rough work so you have to write down so by question it is given that what is the cost of painting one square decimeter it is rupees 2.25 so cost of painting Cost of painting one square decimeter. One square decimeter is equal to rupees. How much is that? It is 2.25. 2.25 is 
it is 2.25 okay now what is the cost of painting 2590.72 square decimeter so you should multiply it by rupees 2.25 okay so cost of painting cost of painting 2590.72 square decimeter is equal to rupees is equal to rupees what 2.25 should be multiplied by 2.25 should be multiplied by 2590.72 so i think you have understood it so let us multiply it so we have multiply with this okay sir 2590.72 it is multiplied by 2.25 so let us multiply it okay so you know how to multiply it 5 twos are 10 0 1 7 fives are 35 plus 1 is 36 3 five zeros are 0 plus 3 is 3 5 nines are 45 5 uh, 4 five fives are 25 plus 4 is 29 2 five twos are 10 plus 2 is 12 is that clear 5 twos are 10 0 1 7 fives are 35 plus 1 is uh, 36 6 3 five zeros are 0 plus 3 is 3 Five nines are 45, five, four. Five fives are 25 plus four is 29, nine, two. Five twos are 10 plus two is 12. So it is cross. So it is two twos are four, right? Two twos are four, seven twos are 14, four, one, two zeros are zero, one. Two nines are 18, eight, one. Five twos are 10 plus one is 11. One, two twos are four plus one is five, okay? So this is double cross. Again, two twos are four. Two sevens are 14, four right then one two zeros are zero plus one is one two nines are eighteen eight one five twos are ten plus one is eleven one two twos are four plus one is five so i think you have understood it okay so let us add them zero right six plus four is ten zero one four plus four eight plus four twelve two one six plus one seven plus four eleven seven plus four is eleven 1, 10 plus 8, 18 plus 1 is 19. 19, right? And 10 plus 8, 18 plus 1 is 19. 1, 3 plus 1 is 4, 8 plus 4 is 12. 12, 2, 1. Uh, this is 8 and this is 5. So, you can add this. 0, 6 plus 4 is 10, 1. 4 plus 4 is 8 plus 4 12, 1, 6 plus 1, 7 plus 4 is 11, 1, 10 plus 8, 18 plus 1 is 19, 1, 3 plus 1, 4, 4 plus 8 is 12, 2, 1, uh, 3 plus 5 is 8, then it is 5. So, here after decimal point, there, there, there are two figures. Here also after decimal point, there are two figures. 2 plus 2 is 4. So, you have to write down decimal point here before four figures. In this case, you after decimal point, you have two figures. Huh? After decimal point, you have two figures. Huh? 2 plus 2 is 4. 4 figures. So, we have decimal point. 4 figures are already decimal. Long. Last, we have 4 figures. We have decimal point. 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah. So, you double zero. So, cancel. So, which is equal to rupees? What is the answer? Is equal to rupees? 5829.5. Point one two. So this is the final answer. So what is the cost of painting? Painting all the surfaces of right circular cylindrical pipe. It is rupees five eight two nine point one two. So that is your answer. That is rupees five thousand eight hundred twenty nine point one two. So that is the final answer. So I think you have understood it. So you can copy it. Now we'll do the next question. So now we'll do the next question that is question number 14. So question number 14 is Height of a hollow right circular cylinder open at both ends is 2.8 meter. 
फिर यहाँ बंद हलो राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंडर हलो बने भिता के नीक हलो बने भिता के नीक ठीक है सो इट्स हाइट इज टू पॉइंट एट मीटर ओपन एट बोथ द एंड्स ओपन एट बोथ द एंड्स बोथ एंड के खुला ठीक है इसको दुईटा एंड होगाड़ी को एंड एट पछाड़ी को एंड दुईटा एंड के खुला ठीक है सो इफ द लेंथ अफ इनर डायमिटर अफ द सिलिंडर इज फोर पॉइंट सिक्स डेसिमीटर व्हाट इज द इनर डायमिटर अफ द सिलिंडर इट इज फोर पॉइंट सिक्स डेसिमीटर एंड दिस सिलिंडर इज मेड अप अफ एटी फोर पॉइंट फोर एट क्यूबिक डेसिमीटर अफ आइरन तो जो हलो हलो सिलिंडर छैट हलो सिलिंडर इज मेड अप अफ एटी फोर पॉइंट फोर एट क्यूबिक डेसिमीटर अफ आइरन दैट मीन्स द वॉल्यूम अफ दैट हलो राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंडर इज दैट इज द वॉल्यूम अफ दैट हलो राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंडर इज एटी फोर पॉइंट फोर एट क्यूबिक डेसिमीटर डेसिमीटर राइट सो लेटेस्ट क्याकुलेट द लेंथ अफ आउटर डायमिटर अफ द सिलिंडर तो तिमें कि निर्णन पर्व आउटर डायमिटर अफ द सिलिंडर से निन्न पर्च तो इसमें व्हाट इज द वॉल्यूम अफ द हलो राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंडर यो था आज फिर मैं फिगर बना अलग हलो बने याद भैया भि खोक्रो ठीक So this is the uh, hollow right circular cylinder, right? This is the hollow right circular cylinder. Okay. This is the hollow right circular cylinder. This is the hollow right circular cylinder. Okay. Now suppose its inner radius, inner radius is R1, and its outer radius is R2. Outer radius is what? R2, and inner radius is R1. Okay. And what is its height? Suppose is its height is h. Okay. So now in this case you have to find out the volume of the hollow right circular cylinder. So how can you find out the volume of hollow right circular cylinder? Bhitra ta ke bhin saena? Hollow bane ko bhitra ke hi pani na ba? Bhitra khokro bhai ko? Tela se ami ke bancha hollow right circular cylinder bane ra bancha. So how can you find out the volume? To tyo volume hollow right circular cylinder ko volume ami kaise nikalcha? Pehla outer radius le ra. You have to find out the volume of the cylinder. That is your pi r1 square h. Okay. Or you bhitra ko volume nikalnu. You just say khali portion sir. Tio khali portion ko ami volume nikalnu using r1 as the inner radius. Ko di bata isko volume pi r1 square h. So you pi r2 square h baata pi r1 square h ko hota udhar se amro kya nisin sir volume of the हलो राइट सर्कुलर सिलिंडर को वॉल्यूम निस्किन दैट इज योर पाई आर वन स्क्वायर एच माइनस पाई आर टू स्क्वायर एच ओके नाउ लेट्स डू दिस सल्यूसन नाउ तो यहाँ हम फर्मुला में लिख सो आर वन से के आर वन इज इक्वल टू इनर रेडियस आर वन इज इक्वल टू इनर रेडियस आर टू इज इक्वल टू वट आउटर रेडियस R2 is equal to outer radius. Is that clear? So h is equal to height of the height of the hollow cylinder. H is equal to height of the hollow cylinder. Hollow cylinder, right? So this R2 from here up to here, this R2 is the outer radius, and from this center up to this point, that is R1 is the inner radius. And what is h? H is the height of the hollow cylinder. So therefore, volume of the hollow cylinder, volume of the hollow cylinder. How can you find it? Volume of the hollow cylinder is equal to what is the formula? 
volume of the hollow cylinder is equal to pi r2 square h you have means supply ko volume nikali I mean, your outer radius use the I mean, volume of the cylinder nikali to you jun chai bitra khali portion cha tyo pan the cylinder yo tyo khali portion cha hamile minus garnu parcha that means minus pi r1 square h right so what is common out here pi within bracket r2 square minus r1 square bracket closed then h so this is the formula for volume of the hollow right circular cylinder which is equal to pi within bracket r2 square minus r1 square into h where h is the height of the hollow cylinder r2 is the outer radius of the hollow cylinder and r1 is the inner radius of the hollow cylinder so i think you have understood it so now let's do this question now so now in the question it is given that what is the height of the hollow cylindrical hollow right circular cylinder what is the height of the hollow right circular cylinder open at both the ends it is 2.8 meter so let us write here h is equal to what is h is equal to this is 2.8 meter but in this case since volume is given in terms of cubic decimeter let us convert this meter into decimeter you meter la bhane hami kebe lanchau decimeter mane bhane decimeter mane lanchau the meter the kit decimeter sano unit va you have to multiply you have to multiply by 10 so is equal to 2.8 into 10 is equal to 280 and after decimal point there is only one figure so you have to write down decimal point before one zero so which is equal to 28 decimeter is that clear so i think uh, you have understood this figure you don't have to uh, draw the figure okay just try to understand it the figure no one other news just try to understand it okay so what is the height of the hollow cylinder it is 28 decimeter okay now here inner diameter is given as 4.6 decimeter inner diameter inner diameter is equal to what is it it is 4.6 decimeter 4.6 decimeter so let us find out the inner radius suppose r1 is the inner radius so r1 is equal to inner radius which is equal to 4.6 divided by 2 which is equal to 2.3 decimeter that is your r1 okay and now the cylinder is made up of 84.48 cubic decimeter of iron that is the volume so you should understand that this is the volume of the hollow cylinder let us calculate the length of outer diameter of the cylinder the outer diameter of the cylinder so let us assume the outer radius of the cylinder let r2 be the outer radius outer radius of the cylinder of the cylinder okay now let us find out the volume volume of the hollow cylinder so therefore volume of the hollow cylinder therefore volume of the hollow cylinder is equal to what is the formula that you can use here you can use this formula pi within bracket r2 square minus r1 square into h right so which is equal to pi keep it as it is and within second bracket r2 square we don't know minus what is r1 square what is r1 it is 2.3 it is 2.3 whole square second bracket is closed and what is the height the height is given as 28 the height is given as 28 we have converted this height in terms of dec uh, decimeter right so what is the value for pi pi is 22 by 7 so it is r2 square minus what is 2.3 into 2.3 let us multiply it so 2.3 into 2.3 let us multiply them 3 3s are 9 3 2s are 6 
2 3s are 6 2 2s are 4 so it is 9 6 plus 6 2 2 1 5 529 so after decimal point here it is one figure here decimal point ko pachari euta figure cha here decimal point ko pachari euta figure cha 1 plus 1 kati ba 2 ta yaha hami le decimal lekha two figure ko agadi decimal lekhnu from the last okay that is 92.5.29 so it is 5.29 into 28 is that clear so you can cancel it 7 1 7 this is 7 4 28 okay so now let us simplify it again which is equal to now multiply 22 into 4 this 22 into 4 is 88 is equal to 88 within bracket this is your r2 square minus 5.29 5.29 right this is cubic decimeter cubic decimeter so, we have a problem the volume of the cylinder. 88 into R2 square minus 5.29 cubic decimeter. Don't simplify it now. But by question, but by question, what is the volume? What is the volume of the hollow cylinder? It is 84.48 cubic decimeter. But in the question, it is given that the cylinder is made up of 84.48 cubic decimeter of iron. That means the volume of the hollow cylinder is this much. Okay? But by question volume of the cylinder volume of the cylinder is equal to 84.48 cubic decimeter. So now our Hamile is Habgarera 88 into R2 square minus 5.29 cubic decimeter. But by question it is 84.84 uh, 84.48 cubic decimeter. So these two must be equal. You do it equal So therefore 88 R2 square minus 5.29 into 88. So I think you have understood it. Okay. Now 88, it is taken to the right hand side, it goes to the denominator. You should write down this 88 in the denominator on the right hand side, okay. So R2 square minus 5.29 is equal to 84.48 divided by 88. So I think you have understood it, okay. So you can cancel it by 11. 11 8 za 88, 11 li, 11 7 za 77, isn't it? 11 7 za 77, point, right? So 84 minus 77 is 7, 74, right? So 11 6 za 66, 11, 11 6 za 66, so 74, 11 7 za 77, right? So 84 minus 77 is 7, 74. 11, 6 is 66. So 74 minus 66 is 8, 88. 11, 8 is 88. I think you have understood it. Again, you can cancel it by 8. 8, 1 is 8. 7 is 0. 0.8, 1 is 8. Oh, sorry. This is 8, 1 is 8, isn't it? This is your 8, 1 is 8. 7 is 0. 0.76. 8, 9 is 72. 8 nines are what? 72. So 76 minus 72 is 4, 48. 8 6 are 48. That is your 0 0.96. So I think you have understood it. Okay. So or R2 square minus 5.29 is equal to 0 0.96. I think you have understood it. So now you have to find out the value for R2 now. So let us get the value for R2 now or R2 square is equal to R2 square is equal to 0 0.96 0 0.96 plus what 5.29 5.29 or R2 square is equal to let us add them you know how to add these decimal uh, numbers isn't it so that is 0 0.96 
तो यो डेसिमल को मुनी बड़ी डेसिमल है उन्हें पर्स डेसिमल आफ्टर डेसिमल पॉइंट देर इस टू नाइन यू राइट टू नाइन बिलो नाइन सिक्स एंड बिलो दिस जीरो यू टू राइट फाइव ओके सो ऐड देम नाइन प्लस सिक्स इस फिफ्टीन फाइव वन टेन प्लस टू इस ट्वेल्व टू वन फाइव प्लस वन इस सिक्स दैट इज योर सिक्स पॉइंट टू फाइव सो इट इज सिक्स पॉइंट टू फाइव सो आई थिंक यू अपन स्टूड इट ओके सो सो व्हाट इज आर टू नाउ आर टू इज इक्वल टू स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ सिक्स पॉइंट टू फाइव सो कैन यू फाइंड आउट द स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ सिक्स पॉइंट टू फाइव <coughs> you have to get the square root of 6.25 so you know the method how to get the square root of 6.25 you have done it in class 6 or 7 i think okay so let us find out the square root of 6.25 ta yaha bich ma point cha bhane chai point ko pachadi yo 2 ko jodi 5 linu 6 ko jodi chaina aba thik cha so kun chai testai testai number multiply garda bhane 6 bhanda kamti huncha 2 to the 4, 3, 3 is a 9. So it is 2 times. 2 to the 4. 6 minus 4 is 2. Point. I mean, 2 is a number. 25. So you 2 is a number. So 2 plus 2 is 4. Now, this is the number. Now, this is the number. 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 2 to 5 pounds. That is 5, isn't it? This is 5. This is also 5. 5 5 is 25 5 2 5 4 is 20 plus 2 is 22 so this is cross that is your 2.5 so or this is r2 is equal to 2.5 so this is the outer radius of the cylinder so what is the outer radius of the cylinder it is 2.5 decimeter is that clear so write down outer radius Outer radius is equal to 2.5 decimeter. But in this case, you have to find out the length of the outer diameter of the cylinder. So how can you find out the length of the diameter from the radius? So radius should be multiplied by 2 to get the outer diameter of the cylinder. So therefore, length of the outer diameter of the cylinder of the cylinder is equal to this 2.5 should be multiplied by 2 right so 2 5s are 10 0 1 2 2s are 4 plus 1 is 5 so after decimal point there is only one figure so you have to write down decimal point before 1 0 this 0 will be cancelled which is equal to 5 decimeter so this is the final answer. So what is the answer for length of the outer diameter of the cylinder? It is 5 decimeter. So I think you have understood it. So you can copy it. We'll do the next question now. So now we will do question number 15. So this question number 15 is very very important. Okay. So the question says that height of a right circular cylinder is twice of its radius. Kune oda cylinder sa kyo cylinder ko height say it is twice of its radius. So kyo cylinder ko radius ko double zikhe sa height sa. Okay. Now if the height would be 6 times its radius, then the volume of the cylinder would be greater by 539 cubic decimeter. So if the height would be greater by 6 times its radius, then the volume of the cylinder will be more by 539 cubic decimeter. So let us write by calculating the height of the cylinder. height of the cylinder Question uh, yeah, this, huh? Height of a right circular cylinder is twice of its radius. Kune a right circular cylinder, sa? Tesco radius ko dui gunachi ke sa? Height sa? 
Now, if the height would be six times of its radius, then the volume of the cylinder would be greater by 539 cubic decimeter. But the question says that if the height would be more by six times its radius, then the volume of the cylinder would be greater by 539 cubic decimeter. So you have to find out the height of the cylinder. So I think you have understood it. So let us write here, let R be the radius of the right circular cylinder. So solution. Now the first part is height of the cylinder is twice of its radius. Okay. Let the radius of the cylinder, let the radius of the cylinder be R. Let H be its height. So H be its height. So by question you can write down that H is equal to 2R because height is twice of its radius. So you can write here H is equal to 2R. Is that clear? So in this case let us find out the volume of the cylinder. Therefore volume of the cylinder Therefore, volume of the cylinder is equal to what is the formula? It is pi r square h, which is equal to this pi, keep it as it is. Don't write down the value for pi in this case. Keep it as it is, that is pi, okay? So what is the value for r? Uh, radius is r itself, r square into what is h? It is 2r. So which is equal to, this is 2 pi r cube. This is 2 pi r cube, okay? So this is the volume of the cylinder which is given in the first part of the question. Okay. Now if the height would be six times its radius. Now, now the height is the height is six times six times of its radius. six times of its radius. Now it becomes 6 R now. Now the height would be six times its radius. Okay. So what is the volume now? Therefore volume of the cylinder, volume of the cylinder. What is the formula? What is the volume of the cylinder? It is pi r square h. You know the formula, right? So using this formula, let us find out the volume of the cylinder, which is given in the second part of the question. So it is pi, what is uh, r, r square, what is h? It is 6r, which is equal to 6 pi r cube. This is 6 pi r cube. Now, this is the volume of the cylinder given in the second part of the question. And this is the volume of the cylinder given in the first part of the question. So this volume of the cylinder is more than this volume of the cylinder by how much? This minus this. So volume of the cylinder is more by volume of the cylinder volume of the cylinder will be greater by will be greater by is equal to this 6 pi r cube minus 2 pi r cube your 6 pi r cube say your 2 pi r cube banda kati jada sa banera bandis. That is, volume of the cylinder will be greater by, but I'm sick or so, I mean, you do it minus or so. So, this is 6 pi r cube minus 2 pi r cube, which is equal to 4 pi r cube. That is, the volume of the cylinder would be greater by 4 pi r cube. But by question, it is given as 439. Okay? So, write down. But by question, but by question but by question volume would be greater by volume would be greater by volume would be greater by is equal to 539 cubic decimeter volume would be greater by is equal to 539 cubic decimeter so you can equate this to these are same, isn't it? So you can equate 4 pi r cube is equal to 539. Now let us simplify it. 
so it is 4 into 22 by 7 into r cube is equal to 539 okay now you can cross multiply this is uh, 88 into r cube is equal to 7 into 539 right so this is your r cube is equal to 7 into 539 divided by this is your 88 so let us simplify it at the s like what it is answer 11 legends 11 8 are 88 11 li 11 4 are 44 53 minus 44 is 9 99 uh, that is your 99 isn't it so 11 9s are 99 11 9s are 99 isn't it that is 11 8 are 88 11 4 are 44 53 minus 44 is 9 99 11 9s are 99 okay so we get r cube is equal to 7 into 49 divided by 8 So now next or r cube is equal to this is your r cube is equal to 7 into uh, 49 49 can be written as 7 into 7 and this is 8 8 can be written as 2 cube that is r cube is equal to 7 cube divided by 2 cube or now this is r cube is equal to 7 by 2 whole cube so if the powers are equal bases must be equal that means what is the value for r r is equal to 7 by 2 so this is the radius of the cylinder okay now in this case you have to calculate the height of the cylinder therefore height of the cylinder so height of the cylinder how can you get it you have to calculate the height of the cylinder so how can you get the height of the cylinder what was the height of the cylinder in the first part it was twice its radius that is 2r right so is equal to 2 into 7 by 2 here 2 2 gets cancels so which is equal to 7 what is the unit since the volume is greater by 539 cubic decimeter cubic decimeter unit is given so height of the cylinder is 7 decimeter so this is the final answer so i think you have understood it so you can copy it now we'll do the next question now so now we'll do the next question that is question number 16 so you have to understand this question okay a group of fire brigade personnel carried a right circular cylindrical tank filled with water and pumped out water at a speed of 420 meters per minute to put out the fire in 40 minutes by three pipes of two centimeter diameter each the key got this agony fire brigade personnel ko manche a right circular cylindrical tank sir and it is filled with water and they pumped out water at a speed of 420 meters per minute to put out the fire in 40 minutes by how many pipes three pipes each of diameter two centimeters each of diameter two centimeters okay the key got a fire brigade personnel agony bonu for 40 minutes ma'am the they pumped out water at a speed of 420 meters per minute by the three pipes Tinta pipe lene agu ni baundai se tina le. To tio tinta pipe ko each ko diameter ko tiro isa two centimeters. Tio tinta pipe ko length of diameter ko tisa two centimeters each. Is the question clear? Now, if the diameter of the tank is two point eight meter, tio tank ko diameter ko tiro isa two point eight meter raisa. Only its length is six meter. So, the length of the tank is 6 meters. Then let us calculate number one, what volume of water has been spent to put, uh, to put out the fire. So, what volume of water is used to put out the fire? So, what is the volume of water volume of water used? And number two, the volume of water that still remains in the tank. So, the tank is used to put out the fire. 
त्यो पनि तिमीहरुले निकाल्नु पर्छ त क्वेशन आई थिंक अपन अंडरस्टुड द क्वेशन त यहाँ के भन्दै छ पहिले हामी के निकाल्यौ त्यो ट्याङ्कमा कति पानी छ त्यो निकाल्नु पहिला त यहाँ क्वेशनले भन्दै छ व्हाट इज द डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क इट इज 2.8 मिटर व्हाट इज द डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क इट इज 2.8 मिटर एन्ड व्हाट इज द लेंथ अफ द ट्याङ्क इट इज 6 मिटर्स ओके त हामी के गरौँ यहाँ अ एला हामी डेसिमिटरमा लैजु त डेसिमिटरमा लाग्यो भने भोल्युम निकाल्नु पनि सजिलो हैन सो डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क सो लेट्स डू द सोलुसन व्हाट इज द डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क सो डायमिटर अफ द ट्याङ्क इज इक्वल टु 2.8 मिटर सो इट्स रेडियस so its radius is equal to what is the radius now its radius kati bha 2.8 divided by 2 is equal to 1.4 meter 1.4 meter ta ela hami ke ma lanchau decimeter ma lanchau thik cha ta meter dekhi decimeter ma lada aba hami sanu unit ma lanu paryo ta sanu unit ma lada agi nai maile bhane pahila online class ma pani maile bhaneko ho ठूलो यूनिट देखि सानो यूनिट में चेंज करता फिर हम मल्टिप्लाई कर मीटर देखि डेसिमीटर एक स्टेप तल जानूपर् एक स्टेप सानो यूनिट में जानूपर्यो तो हम टेन ने मल्टिप्लाई कर सो वन पॉइंट फोर इंटू टेन इज इक्वल टू वन फोर्टी सो आफ्टर डेसिमल पॉइंट दे सुड बी वन फिगर सो बिफोर वन जीरो यू राइट डाउन द डेसिमल पॉइंट सो दिस जीरो विल बी कैंसल which is equal to 14 decimeter so this is your radius of the tank okay what is the length what is the length of the tank so length of the tank so length of the tank is equal to this is your six meters so convert into decimeter again meter is coming decimeter six into uh, 10 which is equal to 10 six are 60 decimeter so let us find out the volume of water in the tank the Junse tank ma pani sa, tiyo pani, it is filled with water, tiyo pani lepani tank ko shape lincha, right? Circular cylinder ko shape lincha. So, what is the volume of water in the tank? It is pi r square h, right? So, therefore, volume of water, volume of water in the tank, volume of water in the tank is equal to, what is the formula? It is pi r square h, okay? So pi means 22 by 7. What is the radius? It is 14 whole square is the radius into what is the height or length of the tank? It is 60. Okay. So let us simplify it. Which is equal to 22 by 7 into 14 into 14. 14 into 14 into 60. Right. 7 1 are 7. 7 2 is uh, 14. So let's multiply it. It is 44 into 0, 6 fours are 24, 2, 6 ones are 6, plus 2 is 8. That is 840. Right? So now let us multiply it. 840 should be multiplied by 44. 22 twos are 44, and 14 into 60 is, uh, that is your 840. Right? So 840 should be multiplied by 44. Let us multiply it. Okay? So, 4 zeros are 0, 4 fours are 16, 6, 1, 8 fours are 32, plus 1 is 33, 4 zeros are 0, 4 fours are 16, 6, 1, 8 fours are 32, plus 1 is 33. So, it is 0, 6, 9, 6, 3. The kati bayo is equal to 3, 6, 9, 6, 0 cubic decimeter. This cubic decimeter, this is the volume of water in the tank, okay? So now, uh, cubic decimeter means liter, you know that, one cubic decimeter is equal to one liter. So this is, you can write it in terms of liters, 3690 liters. That is volume of water in the tank is equal to 36960 liters. Eti tank ma sir. Take sir. Now, what question Per minute. एक मिनट में कती पानी जाने सा 420 मीटर एक मिनट में कती पानी जाने सा 420 मीटर राइट 
तो बने बसी 40 मिनट्स में कौन सी पानी जान्सा? 40 मिनट्स में कौन सी पानी जान्सा? 420 into 40, right? So here you can write. Therefore, in one minute, that is, uh, they can uh, they pumped out the fire brigade personnel pumped out water at a speed of 420 meters per minute by three pipes isn't it the three pipes pumped out water at a speed of 420 meters per minute ek minute ma kati pani jandai sa 420 meters to 40 minutes ma kati pani jancha tyo nikalne thik sa in one minute uh, in one minute water is equal to water used in one minute water used is equal to 420 meter 420 meter right so in how many minutes now 40 minutes ma chai abu unale aguni bauncha bhane chai 40 minutes samma kati pani jancha kati meter pani jancha tyo nikalne so therefore in in kati minutes bhayo 40 minutes in 40 minutes water used water used is equal to in 40 minutes water used is equal to 420 into 40 which is equal to now let us multiply it 0 0 0 0 isn't it 4 to the 8 4 for the 16 that is your 16800 that is 16800 meter isn't it one six eight double zero 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 four two side four four side sixteen meter the eleven yeah me came and so decimeter my line answer land so the decimeter my land after you meter like this and other ten they multiply or so the ten they multiply gonna be the cause of one six eight or triple zero triple zero decimeter so in 40 minutes water used is equal to 16800 decimeter this is just like your height of the pipe that are actually height of the pipe hai nai to you ami le height of the pipe lina saksho elai bujhe timako sajilo ko lagi chai elai ami ke banauchau height of the pipe banauchau thik cha kinu height of the pipe elai banayo bhane chai ami lai problem garnu ekdamai sajilo huncha thik cha tara actually height of the pipe haina ni yo thik cha so height of the pipe height of the pipe is equal to one six eight triple zero decimeter one six eight triple zero decimeter okay now to you jun say pani fang this one and they are going to go no tinta pipe le fangs to tinta pipe go protect or diameter got this a two centimeter okay so let us write here now Let us write here now diameter of each pipe, diameter of each pipe. Protect pipe ko diameter ko this huh? 2 centimeter. Therefore, its radius, therefore, its radius is equal to 2 by 2 is equal to 1 centimeter. Abo elapani amike ma change garso, decimeter ma change garso. अब सेंटीमीटर देखि डेसिमीटर चाहिँ अलिकति ठुलो युनिट भयो त ठुलो युनिट मा चेन्ज गर्दा हामी 10 ले डिवाइड गर्छौ ठीक छ सेंटीमीटर देखि डेसिमीटर एक स्टेप मात्रै हामी ठुलो युनिट मा जान्छौ त्यही कारण 10 ले डिवाइड गरिन्छ सो 1/10 10 ले 1 ले डिवाइड गर्नु एकदमै सजिलो छ 1 को पछि एउटा 0 छ भने माथि एउटा फिगर अरु डेसिमल लाउनु 1 पॉइंट त्यहाँ यहाँ 0 डेसिमीटर भइगो ठीक छ यो चाहिँ म uh, this is just like your radius of the pipe. Radius of the pipe. Take sir. So now, volume of water, volume of water through one pipe. So this is, about you, you pipe, let's say, what the volume of water facts? What the water facts? What the water pipe, what the water facts? What the cubic decimeter water facts? What the water facts? So volume of water through one pipe. Volume of water through one pipe 
is equal to what is the formula pi r square h again my name money you don't say Emily you need to 16 1 6 8 triple 0 decimeter to have a kill inside of the pipe so this is my me it's long so are when you go your radius pi when you go pi when you go 22 by 7 okay so pi when you go the whole this is 22 by 7 what is the radius here what is the radius Radius of the pipe is 0 0.1 whole square into what is the height? What is the height here? Height of the pipe? This much. Uh, right. That is 168000. 168000. Okay. So you can cancel it. 7 ones are 7. 7 twos are 14. 16 minus 14 is 2. 16 minus 14 is 2. 28. 7 fours are 28. And how many zeros? Three zeros. Right. So, which is equal to 22 into what is 0 0.1 into 0 0.1? Uh, 0 0.1 into 0 0.1. One ones are one, right? So, after decimal point, there is one figure. After decimal point, there is one figure. This is just like this one 0.1 into 0.1. That is one ones are one. After decimal point, there is only one figure. After decimal point, there is also one figure. One plus one is two. So, you have to write down decimal point before two figures one and zero. Or a zero add one. So, you can 0 0.01. So, point is 0. So, into you can 24,000. I think you have understood it. This is the volume of water through only one pipe. Okay? So, okay, what is 36960. 36960 liters. 36960 liters pani chai kaha cha tank ma cha haina 36960 liters pani chai so let us multiply it which is equal to 22 into now multiply it 24000 into 1 is 24000 24000 right so after decimal point, how many figures are there? Two figures. So you have to write down decimal point before two figures. That is before two zeros. This will be cancelled. So is equal to 22 into 240. This is 22 into 240 now. So let us multiply them. 240 into 22. Let us multiply it. 0, 4, 2, 0, 2, 2, 0, 4. 0, 2, 4, 0, 2, 2, 0, 4. So 0, 8. This is 5280. So, which is equal to, I think it's correct. 2 zeros are 0, 2 fours are 2 twos are 4. Okay, 0, 8, 5280. 5280 liters. So, I think you have understood it. Okay, so you have a volume of water through one pipe. There are three pipes along this. Three pipes along this. So, what is the volume of water through three pipes? Therefore, volume of water, volume of water through three pipes, volume of water through three pipes, T H R O U G H, volume of water through three pipes. So, what is the volume of water through three pipes? Volume of water through one pipe is this much. Volume of water through three pipes is equal to three multiplied by five two eight zero liters. So let us multiply it. Three zeros are zero. Three eights are twenty four four two. Three twos are six plus two is eight, and five threes are fifteen. That is fifteen thousand eight hundred forty. Let's check it once again. Three zeros are zero. Three eights are twenty four four two. Three twos are six plus two is eight, and three fives are fifteen. So this much liters of water has been used. So this much liters of water has been used to has been used in putting out the fire. Okay, the 80 liter pani chai chalayo to put out the uh, to put out the fire in 40 minutes by three pipes. Okay, so therefore volume of water used or volume of water spent volume of water spent. Volume of water is spent in putting out the fire. In putting out the fire 
in putting out the fire is equal to how much is that 15,840 liters so this is the answer so volume of water is spent in putting out the fire is equal to 15,840 liters okay that is the answer for the first part so what is the second part here you have to find out the volume of water that still remains in the tank the tank ma jamma pani kati thiyo 36,960 liters pani thiyo this minus that okay now write down therefore therefore volume of water volume of water that still remains in the tank that still remains in the tank in the tank is equal to you use by your tank in my 36,960 liters the bunny busy cotty right hour you 36,960 what is a you minus 15,840 that is three six nine six zero minus 15,840 so let us subtract it 0 minus 0 is 0 6 minus 4 is 2 9 minus 8 is 1 6 minus 5 is 1 3 minus 2 is 1 liters okay so this is the answer so what volume of water that still remains in the tank that is 21,120 liters let us check it once again 0 minus 0 is 0 6 minus 4 is 2 9 minus 8 is 1, 6 minus 5 is 1, 3 minus 1 is 2. That is, volume of water that still remains in the tank is equal to 21,120. So, what volume of water has been spent? Has been spent in putting out the fire? It is 15,840 liters. And, and uh, what volume of water that still remains in the tank? That is, volume of water that still remains in the tank is equal to 21,120 liters. So these are the answers. So I think you have understood it. So this much is for today. So we did four problems today. You revised it at home. Okay. revision The next class we will do more problems on this right circular cylinder. So this much is for today. The government say your Ramrasanga revision. Okay.